Good morning and welcome in. I am the Canadian trucker Rudy and I am here with Diego. I'm Trucker's Rudy's son. Well, thank you guys for joining my channel and stay tuned for the rest of my day. Good morning, good morning everyone. Have a look around. If you think it gets too cold for camping, think again. No way, right? We are camping with my good friend up here. Oh, yeah, fast sweater. Oh yeah, and especially if you have your lady with you, eh? Oh, sleeping in that big camper up in there with the furnace on, you know? Oh, you can't be asking for anything better than that. Lovely lovely weather but everybody else seems to have moved out as you can see those guys over there those guys over there they're all gone oh don't matter to us right we, we still gonna go get uh, the fire going right or we already got it going right and we're gonna do some bacon and eggs right yes. for this morning who's ready for bacon and eggs huh Me. you Me. look at that we got the we got the fire going already. We're going to have some bacon and eggs this morning. Oh, we got a little bit of snow up here in the corners. A little bit of built up over here, but who cares, right? We're still going to have some bacon and eggs, right? Yes. Oh, lovely. Now we're just going to have to see if we can get the ladies out of the camp. <laughs> oh, well, we're going to go home today, but... Uh, we had a great time so far here at camp, right? Oh yeah, very nice. Yep. Hey guys, it's lunch time. We're still at camp. Who cares about snow, right? Not us. We're camping, cooking some stew. Oh yeah, we're having lots of fun, right? Right? Oh yeah. Yeah? Oh yeah. Yep. Oh, have yeah. A nice... oh yeah. I'm hungry. You're hungry? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. You too? Yeah. Oh, good. Have some nice hot tea. Yeah. Of course. My wife wants to be in the camera too. <laughs> At least you can't reach it. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's why I like this stick, you know. We can do this. <laughs> hey guys, we are at Seven Sisters and as you can see we are looking at the water right here. Really cool, right? Well guys, prepare yourself for what we are going to do. So sit down and relax. This might be a little scary. So stay very tight in your seat. Have a look at this guy. On this side, come with me. Look at this guy. Was that scary or what? That was pretty scary, wasn't it? I, at least I think it was. Look at this side. Oh yeah, going down, going down. pretty scary eh? it's a big waterfall up here look at this side again <laughs> yep let me see if I can show you something I really hope you guys can see this have a look Oop.
Ja. Now this is actually a hydro dam that we got up here. It's called Seven Sisters. I apologize for the wind, but it's always windy around the lakes, right? Usually it is anyways. Yeah. Big hydro dam, that's for sure. At least we get the pleasure of in, uh, enjoying the scenery up here. They got the hydro uh, generators right in here. Want to see if we can actually see something. When we look through it, we can actually see that the, the generators in there that uh, create hydro. Let's have a look. Hopefully we can see something through there. I'm really hoping that you guys are going to be able to, uh, to actually see the hydro dams in there. Just gonna wait for the camera to adjust a little bit and hopefully it's uh, able to look through there. If it is, we'll have that on camera. And uh, we are actually standing here on the uh, on the edge of, of this whole spiel. <laughs> Even I am scared to stand, stand right here. I mean, take a look. Just take a look right here. Yep. That is scary, scary stuff, I'm telling you. Oh, yeah. This is really scary. <laughs> Even for me to walk on this edge, you know. I don't know if you can see that. And you can actually see all the way down to the, to the ground, eh? <laughs> that is scary, scary stuff. I hope you got a good scare out of this stuff too. Well guys, I really hope you guys enjoyed uh, our journey on our waterfall up here today, Hydro Dam. And uh, I don't know if you can see this, but right here is where uh, they got the plates in, all the way across here. And that's where you can actually uh, take these plates off to stop the water eh, from coming down. Like that. Yeah. That's scary, eh? That is pretty high. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like this is where they can uh, put their uh, plates down. Yeah. This is where they put their plates down. They got a measuring gate up there. That's huge, eh? Well, guys. I really, really hope that you guys have enjoyed uh, this hydro dam. I don't know how good uh, you guys are going to be able to read this, but it says right here that this dam was built, or I guess started to be built in 1931, May 9th. I guess in 2006 they rebuilt it or something. But uh, anyways, it was... Uh, a lot of fun going through here and uh, it's actually really close to where we actually camp and uh, we figured we would stop in here for on our way back home you know get some uh, good sceneries for you guys anyways we'll go home now and then we'll see you later we are back at home guys I had me a much needed shower not that we didn't take a shower over there but Cleaning everything up today and you know at the campsite and then at home and went and played a little bit of beach volleyball at church again because it's uh, Monday you know so on Monday evening I have volleyball and I really hope that you guys enjoyed uh, the videos that I have shown to you guys from the hydro dam and that is where we get our hydro from at least a lot of us manitoba hydro it's called and that's where we get our power supply from yeah now i'm kind of busy working for you guys right there on my laptop putting all these video files together and uploading them before i head out again I try to upload as many as I can possibly upload for you guys so that you guys have something to watch 
Yeah, if I don't do this, then there ain't no video for you. <laughs> Anyways, we had a lot of fun this weekend. It was cold, it was warm, it was nice. I mean, it was nice and sunny there on Saturday. We went fishing there, we got 12 fish and we had ourselves a very nice fish fry. It was very lovely, lots of barbecue. Oh, we had a lot of fun. Got a little bit of snow this morning, but by the time we left, almost all of it was gone. Had a little bit of left there and some of the ditches, but other than that, pretty much all of it was gone. But that's the way it is up here in Manitoba. You can never know what the weather is going to do. Well, I kind of figure May long weekend is always a bit of a rainy, cold weekend, but hey, that's okay. My friend has got a very nice camper. He got heat in there, everything. He's got a generator, everything. So, <laughs> I mean, he's got a very nice setup over there. So, we thank him very much for allowing us to come over there and having a great time with us. And that's about it. We hope you guys enjoyed it too. You guys get to see it from the other end. It might be across the continent where you get to watch it. And it's because of me. Nobody else. That's it. Anyways, have a good one. And we will catch you on the next one. Get going, it's time to move on. Put this behind me.